Hi, I'm going to show you the rocks I call and the different type of rocks. First, we will see the sedimentary rocks. They are formed by compaction of sediments or fragments of other rocks at the bottom of a lake. One example of these rocks is the limestone. Here is the limestone. Now, we are going to see metamorphic rocks. They are formed by intense heat and pressure. One example of these rocks is the marble. Here is the marble. The last type of rocks we are going to see are the igneous rocks. Here is a volcano erupting and forming two types of igneous rocks. One of them is over the ground called volcanic rocks or extrusive rocks. Volcanic rocks are formed when magma solidifies. Here we have an example of volcanic rocks called obsidian. Here is the obsidian. The other type of rock is plutonic or intrusive rocks. They are formed underground when the magma solidifies but underground. An example of plutonic rock is Yodan. Here is it. I hope you like this video Guillermo. Bye! Hi guys, today we will learn the rock cycle, so let's start. Sedimentary rocks Sediments are carried by from the mountains to the lake by water flow. Sediments are deposited in the river and they are compacted together by pressure. Then they or oh, they form form the rock called the rock igneous rocks. Sediments are mel are melted by lava. After cooling, they after cooling. Mm, they form obsidian, which is a type of igneous rock. Rocks are next to the lava and heat it, applying pressure to the rocks to compact them together. Thanks for watching my video. I think it isn't the best video of the world, but... Uh, but espero que os sirva de algo. Thanks. There are three types of rocks. Igneous, metamorphic and sedimentary. The igneous rocks are formed when the magma or lava cool down. If the rocks are formed out of the earth's surface, they are extrusive. And if they are formed under the earth's surface, they are intrusive. The sediments are small particles of mud, sand and organic materials. The sedimentary rocks are formed when the sediments accumulate over time. The sedimentary rocks are types of rocks in fossil which be found. And this occurs over time. And the last type of, of rock is the metamorphic rocks. The metamorphic rocks are formed by heat and pressure. And these are all the types of rocks. Thank you and goodbye. The sediments are carried to lay by the water flow. After being compacted, the sand turns to limestone. This is the sedimentary rock. Then the igneous rock is the, se the sediments are melted by lava. By the lava, then it it cools down and solidifies. The obsidian is the it is a igneous rock. Applying pressure to the rock contacts them together.
When it rains, water starts to erode and it can break the materials. <laughs> They are compact together. The sediments begin to sink under the floor. After being compact, sedimentation transforms sand into limestone. The sediments are melted by magma, then they cool down and they form obsidian. The rocks next to the magma are heated, the pressure compact they together. <laughs> 